Today we're going to be doing this makeup tutorial and since I filmed my haul video, I got a lot of questions, I got a lot of um, requests to do this makeup tutorial using um, Guilt by Association from MAC from the Style Black Collection. Um, yeah, so I try to do this one and that's what we're doing today since it's really early in the morning. Um, you know... I didn't really go all out with false lashes and a really big smoky eye. So I did a subtle smoky eye, but it still doesn't look overwhelming for daytimes. Enjoy the video, and I will talk to you guys later and come back for more tutorials. Bye-bye. So anyways, first thing I'm going to do is apply Urban Decay Primer Potion. Looks like this. And I'm only going to apply that on the lid area. Like that and then just blend that out with my ring finger after that um, you might want to use a black base um, I found it that it looks a lot better when you use the black base the colors they show through more like the reflex they show through more so I'm gonna take NYX jumbo pencil in black bean it's just a black one and I'm going to apply this on the lid like that like a very small amount after that you want to take a synthetic bristle brush like this one this is the MAC 242 might be backwards 242 <laughs> and I'm just gonna blend this out You want a thin layer because the thicker it is, the more it's going to crease. And I suggest you try using a base, I mean, um, a primer underneath because this will definitely crease. Alright, so now we're going to take Max Guilt by Association. And this came out with the Max Style Black Collection. So, as you can see, it's pretty much a black, sh a black um, eyeshadow with some gold reflex the Sigma SS um, 275 and it's just an angle brush and I'm gonna take some fix plus and just kind of spray some in the back of my hand easier like when I just spray it on with the brush like directly from the container it just I don't know it just doesn't get the brush wet enough so I'm just gonna go in here and I'm gonna pick some of this eyeshadow up it doesn't really matter where you go just kind of load up your brush like this and we're gonna start by applying this and patting motions first and then you can start by dragging this out Try to keep everything on the lid area only. Now I'm going to take a pencil brush like the SS219 from Sigma. And I'm going to do the same thing, just kind of spray some Fix Plus in the back of my hand. And just get it wet like that and just go back into the shadow and then pick some up and then I'm just gonna drag this underneath so you're kinda connecting it and bringing it around and I'm only stopping right here and just kinda blending it in 
Now you can take a 224 or in this case the SS224. I've been using my Sigma brushes lately a lot. I'm just going to go in and just with the tip I'm going to start by trying to blend the edges out so they're not that harsh and we just kind of want like a smoky effect. So we're just going to smoke out the edges. And if you need to apply more shadow once this dries, it kind of dries really quick, so you're going to just apply more dry shadow on top of that. But these mineralized eyeshadows, they work a lot better when they're wet. <clears throat> Something like this. Um, I'm going to do a highlight, and I'm using a matte um, highlight, and this one is by Anastasia. It looks like this and I'm only going to use this right underneath the brow and I'm just going to blend this with my ring finger and then I'm also going to apply some right here And then just do the same. So this is what we're going for. Something very easy and subtle, but not like overly dramatic. That's why I'm not using any false lashes today. <sighs> Alright, so now I'm going to take Clinique's Black Cream Liner. And this one is in True Black. And I'm just going to take my Sonia Kashuk brush and I'm just going to go in here and pick some eyeshadow, some eyeliner up. And I'm just going to take my finger and just kind of press it in like this. And then just line my waterline. Alright, so now that we have this done, we're going to do mascara, and I'm using Revitalash. Um, it's a mascara that came with my Revitalash. Looks like this. Just kind of really nice, sleek tube, and I'm going to go in and apply a few coats. Right, I'm just going to comb my eyebrows, keep them in place. Alright, so this pretty much completes the whole makeup look. I hope you guys like the quality of the camera because I'm really loving it. Hopefully it, up it uploads um, good and everything. And just one final look at what we did today. kind of look cockeyed if I look at you like this. So, yeah, pretty simple. It kind of looks a little green, but it definitely has like some gold reflex to it. But anyways... I'll talk to you guys later and thank you so very much for watching.